If you want to learn how to start a Etsy print on demand business, then make sure you stick around because in this video, I'm going to share with you how to get set up and rolling so you can start crushing it with your Etsy print on demand business. Let's go. I won't stop. No, 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 no. First step on how to start a Etsy print on demand business is choosing a print on demand provider. For this tutorial, I'm going to choose Printful. You can go over to Printful.com and create a Printful account. Just click right here where it says sign up. After you sign up, you will have access to your Printful dashboard that looks like this. Next step for your Etsy print on demand business is going over to Etsy.com. And right here to the right, you're gonna wanna click on sign in. And then you're gonna wanna click right here where it says register and just fill out your details right here. So once you have your account set up, you're gonna wanna click right here on the top right by your profile picture and click on sell on Etsy. Click right here where it says get started and all you're gonna wanna do is just follow the steps on creating your store, okay? For more detailed instructions on how to connect Etsy with Printful, you can go on Etsy's FAQ section on Printful's website. Link will be in the description for you guys. So as you're setting up your Etsy shop, you're gonna get to this section here that says create a listing. That leads me to the next step, which is create a listing. It's just a mock listing. You can delete it right after. But in order to connect your Etsy shop to Printful, you will need at least one active listing. Let's come right back over here to Printful's dashboard and you're gonna wanna click on product templates. So once you're on this page, all you're gonna wanna do is click right here where it says create your first product template. Now we gotta choose a product example. So I'm gonna click on men's clothing and I'm gonna go with t-shirts. And I'm gonna go with this one right here, this men's premium heavyweight tee. Next thing you're gonna wanna do is add a design. This is just for our mock listing, okay? So we can click on this button right here that says add quick design. And I'm gonna choose this one right here that says happy Halloween. After you drop that design, just click on this button right here that says continue. All you're gonna wanna do is click right here where it says save product template. As you can see, our mock-up is right here. What you're gonna wanna do, right, is click on these three little dots and you're gonna wanna select download mock-ups. I'm gonna go with this one right here. Scroll all the way down and click on generate mockups. Now you can just click on download mockups. Next, go over to Etsy and add those mockup photos. So after you have your mockup photos uploaded, you can scroll all the way down to where it says listing details and for title, you can just take it from the Printful's website. So I'm gonna come back over here. I'm gonna click on this X. I'm gonna click on this. I'm gonna highlight where it says men's premium heavyweight tee. This is just for the sake of getting the store running. We can always delete this listing. So I'm gonna hit copy, go back to Etsy. I'm gonna paste that in where it says about this listing, who made it, I'm gonna click on it and I'm gonna put another company or person. What is it? A finished product. When was it made? Made to order. And for category, you could put in t-shirts just like so. And you wanna give a brief description. So I'm gonna come back over here to Printful, click on see product info. I'm gonna highlight this description, come back over here. I'm gonna paste it in. And once you get your productive partners, you're gonna wanna click right here where it says add a new production partner, okay? And for production partner, you can put in Printful. And for location, you can come over to Printful's contact page. I will leave a link in the description. So all I'm gonna do is find a fulfillment center, for instance, Charlotte, North Carolina. I'm gonna highlight that, come back over to Etsy. I'm gonna paste that in. And as you can see with the United States of America, I'm gonna click on that. And about this production partner, you can type in something like fulfillment company, just like so. And then you're gonna have three questions right here. Why are you working with this partner? Just click on this arrow and then you can click on this first option. I don't have the technical ability or equipment to make it entirely by myself. And for the second one, what is your role in the design process? I design everything myself. And for the third one, what is the partner's role in the production process? They do everything for me. And you're gonna wanna click on save partner. So I already have it saved. So I'm gonna click on cancel. Next thing you're gonna wanna do is add in a price. So I'm just gonna put in 20 right there. When you get to this section right here for origin zip code, you can go back to Printful's contact page and you can get the zip code from one of the fulfillment centers and you're gonna wanna put that in right here. For processing times, if we go to Printful's shipping page, we can see for t-shirts, it takes roughly six to 13 business days, okay? So right here in this section for processing time, I chose five to seven business days. And for item weight, I just put a pound. For item size, five by five by five. This is just for this first listing to have your Etsy store active, okay? And connected with Printful. So what I'm gonna do here is just click on save and continue. All right, so now that you got your first listing out the way, all you have to do is click on this button right here that says do this later. And then you wanna finish off with this whole entire process, okay? How you'll get paid, set up your billing and your shop security. So after completing that setup, completing your billing and adding in your payment information, you should have got that button that says open up your shop. So once you click on that button, 
you're gonna be brought to a page that looks like this okay so obviously this is my demo store now the next step for your Etsy print on demand business is connecting printful to Etsy so what we're gonna want to do right is go over to printful and you're gonna want to click on stores and right here where it says choose platform click on that under Etsy click on connect you want to scroll down a little bit and click on connect to Etsy you will be redirected to Etsy all you want to do is scroll down click on allow access it'll send you back to printful to connect your store all you have to do is click on continue and connect to store and just like that printful is connected to Etsy and if you want to see it for yourself all you have to do is click right here where it says stores and as you can see our Etsy store is connected with printful now the next step for your Etsy print on demand business is adding printful products to Etsy so we're gonna want to click on add product now you're gonna want to choose a product we're gonna go with men's clothing I'm gonna click on t-shirts and I'm gonna click on this t-shirt right here and once you're on this page all you have to do is drop in your PNG design real quick I have a gift for you to kick off your Etsy print-on-demand journey I will give you access to 10 free PNG designs along with 10 AI files it's probably 11 AI files where you can open up those files in Adobe Illustrator and you can edit those design files to your liking and create even more designs to get you on the way. Link will be in the description. So we're going to click on drop your design here. I'm going to click on upload new file and I'm going to locate a design. One thing to keep in mind, any designs that you may have, make sure it's a PNG file, okay? Where there is no background so I'm gonna click on that cartoon head I'm gonna click on open click right here where it says apply so now that the design is uploaded and it's on a black t-shirt now I have options right if I want to actually put this design on a white t-shirt to see how it looks then let me see how it looks and actually I like the way it looks on a white t-shirt so I'll leave that as a selection and let's check this out that's all right so pretty much you can choose your colors okay so choose whichever colors you like I'm gonna try this one I'll keep it why not so I'm gonna go right here where it says proceed to mock-ups now you can pretty much choose your mock-up style okay I'm gonna choose flat mock-up I'm gonna choose this white as the main mock-up image I'm gonna click on proceed to details after you choose your mock-up you're gonna want to give your print on demand product a title so make sure you put some thought into this for SEO purposes and also in your description okay when you get to tags you want to make sure that you add tags to improve your SEO results you know to make your products easier to find keep that in mind guys so I'm just gonna put t-shirt and we could do it like this just like so okay I forgot to mention if you want to add a size guide all you have to do is click on that and there you have it okay you can choose whichever size guide measurement system you like imperial or metric I'm gonna unselect that I'm gonna click on proceed to pricing all right so once we get to this page you can pretty much choose how much profit you want okay so how much you pretty much want to sell this t-shirt I'm just gonna go with 25 okay you can price it at whatever you like I'm gonna click on apply and as you can see my profit margin is nine dollars and five cents okay before we click on submit to store let's talk about shipping when you publish a product on Etsy Printful's shipping rates automatically apply with origin and estimated delivery time okay so you don't have to worry about none of that to see more all you have to do is come over to Etsy click on shop manager and click on orders and shipping once you click on orders and shipping you're gonna to want to click on this button right up here to the top right that says shipping settings and as you can see here are the shipping profiles okay for hoodies pants jackets backpacks all that stuff okay and the pages go on so everything is integrated okay with Etsy and Printful now let's go back to Printful so if you want to offer free shipping to your customers you can easily click on this button right here that says pricing settings and you can enable free shipping just something to keep in mind when you're pricing your products you can actually include that shipping right in your actual retail price okay so you can even bump this up if you like but my goal is pretty much less profits more sales because t-shirts is not the only thing I'm actually gonna be pushing to my Etsy store I'm gonna have a variety of products that I'm actually gonna be selling on my store so something to keep in mind alright guys if you want more profits less sales that's all up to you just keep in mind that when customers are looking at your products and they're overpriced more than likely they're not gonna buy something to keep in mind when you're actually pricing your products all right so if you want to offer free shipping to your customers just enable it and after you do that 
all you have to do is click on submit to store. So now that we have that out the way, let's talk about where to find designs for your Etsy print on demand business. My top recommendation is going to be Creative Fabrica. For just $1, you'll have unlimited access to over 5 million fonts and designs, okay? After your first month, it'll be $19 a month, which comes down to 35% discounted, all right? Highly recommend them for your Etsy print on demand business. Once you're on Creative Fabrica, let's say Halloween is around the corner, right? So let's just type in Halloween designs. Just like that, hit enter. And as you can see, right here to the left, there's categories, okay? I'm gonna click on t-shirt designs. And as you can see, there are a bunch of options for you to choose from, right? And it's as simple as finding whichever design you like that you wanna actually upload on your Etsy print on demand shop, right? So let's say I want to go with this Halloween t-shirt design. I click on it and all you're going to want to do is click on download and a zip file will be downloaded, okay? So once you get that actual file, you can go over to Printful, okay? Let's actually go back to men's clothing. I'm going to go over to t-shirts. I'm going to choose this t-shirt. I'm going to drop a design. I'm going to click on upload new file. I'm going to locate that design. I'm going to make sure it's a PNG. I'm going to click on open. Now I'm going to click on apply. And there you have it guys. There goes the t-shirt design. Okay. You can choose your colors, all that fun stuff. Once you're satisfied with how it looks, you can proceed to mock-ups, choose your mock-up and you're gonna to wanna to proceed to details. Once you get to this page, remember product title, description. If you wanna add a guide, just toggle that and you can add your tags right there. Proceed to pricing, enter your price, and submit to store. It's that simple, okay? So that is how you can sit here and download designs from Creative Fabrica. Next website I wanna share with you is actually Fiverr, all right? Once you get to Fiverr.com, all you have to do is right here in the search bar, you can type in something like t-shirt designs. Hit enter, and you're gonna see a bunch of designers offering their services, okay? But what you can do, right, is right here on the top, you click on budget, and under max, type in five, click apply. And as you can see, you're gonna have a bunch of designers that are available to create a design for you for as low as $5. After you find a designer that you like, all you have to do is reach out to that designer. If you have any ideas in mind, you can easily get ideas from Pinterest. You can type in t-shirt designs. If you see a t-shirt you like on Pinterest, all you have to do, right, is screenshot that image and you can send it to your designer and you can let your designer know that you will like something similar but unique to you, okay? Your designer will go and create that design for you and deliver that design to you and you can sit here, upload that design onto Printful and it'll push over to your Etsy shop, okay? Real simple, guys. There you have it. That is how you can get started with your Etsy print on demand business. Real quick, what products are you planning on adding to your Etsy print on demand business? Let me know in the comment section below. I'm curious to know. Best of all, thank you for watching. Be sure to give this video a like and subscribe to this channel for more videos like this. And I'll see you in the next video.